Today, I'm going to show you how to fix a washing machine, okay? So, if any of you have this situation, watch this. This might save you seven to $1,200 and buying a new washing machine. So, as you can see, this part is broken, all right? So, when it closes, it's not staying shut, okay? So, hopefully, it's not broken off in there, or that's going to be hard. So, I've ordered this new part and we're gonna get it in there, but first I have to take off the door. So apparently I only needed to take out this part and I uh, had unscrewed all around and I noticed this is a separate piece, this is a separate piece. You just need this piece, so now, look so this piece is the one i'm replacing honestly at first i thought it was glued together it's not glued together just wiggle it around pinch pinch these two down together and you're gonna just pull it out okay and then you, this is my brand new one see this is the new one this is the broken one as you can see it chipped off right so that i'm replacing it with this piece so we're gonna go back in there. This is actually a very, very simple issue. Now, my only concern is that if something of is stuck in here, then we're in trouble. Let's see. So make sure you keep all your screws together in a pile, okay? And then we're just gonna pop it right back together. Okay, right, so let's see. These screws are different sizes. These are the, the door screws that go. The other ones were not necessary. You just need to take off two of for that. Or press so you're not stripping anything. So um, now the rest are just going to go in, but the rest of the unnecessary ones. So since these screws are stripping and it's for some reason not easy to screw them in, please avoid the mistake I made by taking all them off. Just take these two for that one piece off because I'm worried I'm stripping all these and I'm having to put a lot of leverage behind my screwdriver and keep my arm really straight and push with some brute force. And I'm, I'm also using, here, I'm using the washing machine to like hold my, hold my elbow firm so I can push harder to get a more direct pressure because it's stripping if you hear that noise. Okay, let's see if it shuts like this. It's probably gonna pop it back, but this one's really bad sticking out. Dun da da! It worked. Is it? Hang on. Let's turn it on. All right, guys, the moment of truth. Let's see. Just so you know, these are really hard to stick in, and it's already stripping. So that's why I'm. Um, see how stripped that is? So let's see if this shuts. Let's turn it on. Okay, door open. Okay, moment of truth. Let's go wide, and we'll see if we can shut this. Woo! Yes! Girl power, Jesus power, I learned everything from my handyman. God is good, but hopefully this saves you guys a lot of money, and remember... You don't have to uh, take all the screws off, just the two. Just the two right here for the mount and the two right here for your piece. There you go. God bless you. Don't mind the mess, but uh, this is the electrolyte washer that we got working. So there we go.